Hey guys, it's Rebecca Oberstadt. In today's video, we are technically working with eight looks and eight palettes. Uh, the first two palettes that you'll see me work with are the Tuscany palette from Nomad Cosmetics and the Taurus Mini Zodiac palette from BH Cosmetics. I then show you looks that I filmed with two other palettes, um, some pictures, and then I film with two more palettes, which is the Ibiza from BH Cosmetics and the Natural Goddess palette that I think is from... Oh, I don't even remember what brand it is. I really want to get rid of that palette. I thought I got rid of it before, but somehow or another it was still in my collection. I just must have forgot to throw it out. Anyways, um, the Natural Goddess palette I got in a boxy charm, and I absolutely hated it. Uh, it's just, it's not that it's a bad quality. It's that it's just a basic bitch palette, and it's definitely not me. Um, kind of like this Tuscany palette from Nomad, but I like the formula and there's some really pretty shimmers in here, so I will keep that. Um, and then I do show you some more pictures at the end of another two looks that I did. So you will see eight different looks like I've been doing with some of the other videos where I will throw in some video footage of me actually doing, um, some looks and then palettes that I use that I don't like film the application. I'm just kind of like sticking the uh, photos and stuff I took of those in the videos as well. All of this is 100% real time. All I have done is cut out, um, you know, like every time I drop something or look for something or hunt for something or you see the side of my head or my forehead or whatever. Um, those are the only times that I have cut anything out. And then at the very end, there's like an outfit reveal because the last look that I did, one was filmed on May 26th, one was filmed on June 8th. And Jason did take me out to dinner one of those nights and he got to pick the tops that I was wearing. So, um, you know, the shirt combo that I have on is, is all Jason and the makeup choice was mine to match the shirt. So yeah, there's that. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and put some music on for a little bit because I have been up all night and it's 11 o'clock in the morning now and I haven't been to bed yet and I'm getting tired and my voice is starting to leave me. So I will come talk to you at the very end.
Alright, so I figured I'd go ahead and leave it with just three songs in here and talk to you. If you notice that the first little bit of this, I tried using a different brush with that Sam. I'm like, where is the product? Now I'm running into this problem. This is the Ibiza palette um, from BH Cosmetics and I was so excited when this palette launched. I couldn't wait to get it. It's so beautiful and it barely works. <laughs> I'm like, what am I doing wrong? It doesn't want to work. Um, the first orange I put on, it was like non-existent. And then the next shadow I put on was so translucent. I tried using a darker shade to go over it. And it, I don't know, for whatever reason, it just didn't seem to want to like work really well. And then look, it's like kind of kind of there but it doesn't want to like place down by my lash line it wants to put it up further up on my eye but it doesn't want to put it where I first put it like what is going on here uh, I had some all sorts of like issues and stuff with trying to get this to work um, on my eyes this palette isn't even that old and it, it gave me all kinds of problems so I'm really wondering um, if just the, because of the cheaper price that the quality of the shadows is just not as good as I thought they were, or they are just are older and that they need, need to go. There's quite a few of the palettes that I had from last year that I bought from their mini Zodiac collection that I go to use them and the pigmentation is like half of what it was when I initially got the product. And it's very sad because I spent money and I got all of them and now I get them and they're very sheer to apply. Um, I had all kinds of issues trying to get this eye look to go and work for me. Um, and the funny thing is, is Jason was like putzing around in the room and I was like, what are you doing? He's like, I was waiting on you. I'm like, I'm waiting on you. He's like, oh. Well, I thought you were filming. I said I was, but I only did that because I didn't know what the hell you were doing. <laughs> so we had we had some communication issues and it was all a lack of not asking each other what the fuck, man. Uh, that's really what it what it boiled down to. The fact that we didn't communicate what each of us wanted or what we were doing or any of that kind of stuff and um, yeah, I thought that was kind of funny because like I come in the room and I'm like, what are you doing now? And he's like, uh, I was just doing this or that. Or I was like, are you, are you ready? Can we go? And he's like, oh, I've been ready. I was like, well, then why didn't you say something? So yeah, that was, it was one of those uh, moments. Uh, that's, oh, that is the Butter London is the natural goddess palette. It's a pretty palette for somebody that likes normal, neutral, everyday um, eye looks and it's just not me. So anyways, there's that. And then this is the other eye look that I did. This was the day that um, he took me to Target to, to go bathing suit shopping. I was feeling like absolute trash when, the, when I was taking these photos. Um, and those were like the best photos I was actually able to get. Uh, I couldn't find any more photos that were better than those. Um, but those were taken in the dressing room after I had picked out my yellow and black bikini. So yeah, here is the outfit to go out to eat. We went to Outback Steakhouse. And yes, that tank top tucked into my jeans makes my belly pudge even worse. Um, and anybody else that says anything about it, I will, I will definitely have a nice snarky remark for you. I can make comments on my body, um, but nobody else really can because it's my body. And yes, I was actually wearing tennis shoes. Don't ask me the brand. I'd have to go look. They're, they're just blue and white. Anyways, what do you guys think? Let me know down below. I'll talk to you later. Bye.